All right, guys, you ready to take a walk down memory lane? <laughs> Let's do this. Um, I have had this since the 90s, okay? And this container had a bunch of just CD cases in it. At least I thought they were. They were full of CDs. I have not got to that thing. But let's just get back to this. Okay, so um, <laughs> I have the Practical Magic um, music from the motion picture. I have that. Ooh, that's pretty. That was pretty. Let me do it again. That's pretty. Um, anyway, and I have no clue what this is. It will not play in my computer. Um, I don't know why all the other ones have been playing. There's, I mean, it's it's scratched significantly less than the ones that have been playing, so I don't know. I don't know if you recognize that. Let me know. It's by, it says Metropolis right there, I believe. Uh, come on, focus. Yeah, it says Metropolis. Uh, I don't know who this is. I have this really cool Rhythms of the Chakras drumming for the body's energy centers. I'm going to leave this in its little container and I'm just going to put it on my little um, my little bookshelf. And then I have Forever Bob Marley. I have this nice tin and one's a nice little book and then three Let me see these in here which I am going to keep this because it's a collector's edition and I really like I really love Bob. So And I'm definitely keeping this in the tin. All right, so those are the ones that I still need to find homes for. I still just need to figure out what's up with that one. And I'm sure there's some in here that don't quite work right, but let's just get into this. All right, so I've taken out the ones that were in there and I've moved them into here. But going through this, I had to laugh because there's just so many. All of these are Halloween. <laughs> Every single one of these are Halloween. This is like Midnight Syndicate, um, Fright Night. Ugh, I can't pull all of these out, I guess. This is the Dead Matter, Cemetery Gates, um, Halloween Party Music. And then these two are Frightmare and Halloween Party. And these two are... This one's Fright Flicks and another Halloween Halloween party music. So all of these are just Halloween music. Yeah. These are all like chill. Um, you'll see. <laughs> this is Nature Quest. Um, and I don't know if either one of these work because look at how scratched up that is. And this one's even worse. This is Nature Quest. So I need to go through and see which ones actually work. Um, this is Mountain Moods. Spirit Flutes. Misty Celtic Morning, Celtic Journey. This is the one that actually prompted me to go through my CDs because it was on my desk and I was cleaning off my desk, but yes, I got sidetracked. Um, but this one my husband just found for me. Uh, they were cleaning out something at his job and um, he found it and brought it home knowing I would like it. And it's funny how many other ones I have. So uh, yeah, this is the new one I just got, which is Celtic Portraits. And then this one I've had Forever's Advent Fleet Migration. And um, I still hear the music in my head from that one. Like, I, And that's from like 1987 Advent Fleet. Okay, so I've had that one a while. Moving on. So I have a very eclectic music taste. I listen to country, rap, rock, um, gothic, new wave, techno, whatever it is. It doesn't matter. I, it's music is music. Music is great. So I've got um, Bone Thugs and Harmony, Dixie Chicks. <laughs> uh, this is Gary Allen. I was obsessed with Gary Allen. I met him. I was in love with him forever. Um, but yeah, this is Gary Allen. Gary Allen. I think I have all of his uh, CDs up until like um, certain. I guess probably. I don't know. I have all of his CDs up until mid mid 2000s I think so I'm not sure I don't have his newer ones but yeah uh Gary Allen Gary Allen uh someone made me this. this is a Hank 3 it says this ain't country um I don't know if it works and I don't remember if it actually is Hank 3 on there so I'll have to check that Selena Marilyn Manson 
uh, you guys might not know about this this group. Um, this was uh, Lifestyle. This is from 1999. Uh, this is Pancho V and Tommy G. Yeah, this is um, this is old school right here. So I'll get into that later. Um, Brandy, Trace Adkins, another Gary Allen, another Trace Adkins. All of these are George Strait, because yes, George is the man. Um, Brian McKnight, love me some Brian McKnight. Uh, I believe this is Gorillas, yeah, Gorillas, Audio Slave. Oh, I miss him. Um, UB40, Labor of Love. Uh, Matchbox 20. And again, it's pretty beat up, so I don't know if it works anymore. So, and some of these I just don't want to get rid of because we've discussed this. Um, Jewel. <laughs> uh, the Wilkinsons. Oh, I don't remember them. I'm going to have to look them up because I don't remember them. Um, another Jewel. Music from the motion picture, The Other Sister. That was such a cute movie. I was obsessed with this movie. Um, and the soundtrack was pretty uh, cute I, from what I remember, but this was like 1989, so. Ugh. I don't know who this is. I, I'm probably way off. I'm going to have to play it to find out who this is. But does anybody recognize that? Let me know. Sixpence, none the richer. Just kiss me in love, but kiss me was my jam, you guys. Back in, what is this, 98? Taking it back. Uh, this is Madonna. Pink, my girl. I went to see her and Lenny Kravitz uh, in concert a long time ago. Uh, Clay Walker. I liked him for quite a bit. Um, another Clay Walker here. Another Clay Walker here. Uh, Leanne Womack. That's my girl. I can sing Buckaroo like nobody's business. Actually, this whole entire CD I was singing. This is when I was usually, I was karaoke a lot. This is 97. So, this is what? 21 years ago. Wow, I'm really old. Um, Leanne Womack, Amy Grant, Craig David. You remember that? Fill me in. Good song, good song. Um, Tim McGraw. We've got The Lens, Woman to Woman. Uh, Tim McGraw, Jessica Andrews. I really, really like, there's one on here. Oh, what is the name of it? Um, sorry, Hungry Love. That song. I'm going to have to sing that song for you guys. This song is so good. Um, Faith Hill. Faith Hill. Faith Hill. I really liked her. And then you've got um, Aiden and Bayside. So it was like, I don't know why. I think I got this from like Hot Topic when I worked there or something. I don't remember. This is from 2005. So in 2005, I was in Vegas. So I think I got this from Hot Topic. I'm going to say. Um, Terry Clark. All of these are Terry Clark. Except this is. Terry Clark was my girl. I loved her. Um, so I've got three of Terry Clark CDs. Brooks and Dunn. Leanne Rhymes. Okay, let me just. Let me just stop. And explain why I have so much country. I was country for quite a while. Like the whole nine yards. Boots. The jeans. The Wranglers. I was going dancing. I was I was deep in it. But I was still listening to like gangster rap. So I mean I was listening to everything. But I was country. Like my whole. Like the way I looked. And I'll insert a picture. Uh, if I can find one. I will insert a picture. <laughs> right here. Yeah y'all enjoy that. Um. So, Leanne Rhymes, Leanne Rhymes, Leanne Rhymes, Mariah Carey, even though I find her very obnoxious now, uh, Reba, Reba is my girl, I loved her TV show too, she's awesome, um, TLC, TLC, Authority Zero, Music for the Nations, Ride the Lightning, this is Metallica, uh, check it out, Sneaker Pump, Spin Spin Sugar, this is 1996. This is 1996. The Offspring. What is this? Oh, Latin Legacy. Another one with, um, like, Lifestyle, Salt Water Records. This is, yeah. That's, that's my home. That's my home, people. Um, Sampler Volume 22. What is this? Um... It looks like a lot of 
honestly, I don't know. 2006 AMP Magazine. Um, oh, Coffin Cats, Buzzkill. Can't say that word on here. I can, but I'm not gonna. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna have to check out that and see what it is. But um, I know the Coffin Cats, so it's like Psychobilly, Rockabilly. So that might be the whole thing. The Drop Trio. Um, I think I went to go see these. There's a jazz. I want to say it's a jazz band. I want to say it's like a jazz. They were a jazz band. I want to see them in Houston. Um, I don't know what ever happened to them, but they were really good. Uh, Passport. Who is this? Okay, let me pull this out because I don't know who this is. Call on Baton Rouge, Two of a Kind, Working on a Full House. This is Garth Brooks, I think. Yeah, Long Neck Bottle. Um, The River, Unanswered Prayers. Yeah, that's Garth. <laughs> um, Crazy Town. Now that I always call my dog Crazy Town. That's funny. But yeah, remember them? Uh, Akon. Olivia. I'm about to biz -ons. Remember that? Remember that? Bette Midler. I love Bette Midler. Shut up. Don't even judge me. Uh, Cherie Austin. Put your heart into it. A lot of these I got like just singles because I was always like karaoke. I was singing these songs and like I would just like listen to them over and over and over again. I was obsessed and I would like learn them and then I would go karaoke them. So I had no life. <laughs> no, but I had a really good time. So Cherry Pop and Daddies. Uh, Lila McCann. Trina. I, I go from kind I go look, you got Cherry Pop and Daddies, Lila McCann, Trina, and Lila McCann. Okay. Can you just see what I'm talking about? I, it's, it's all over the board. Uh, Whitney Houston, Baby Bash, Wilson Phillips, Moby. <laughs> and I don't know if that one works because it looks pretty messed up. Uh, another Madonna, another Gary Allen, Gary Allen, Nelly, Francis and the Muse, Jody Messina, Cottonmouth Kings. Lots of drum and bass, happy hardcore, and jungle. I don't know whose handwriting that is or who made that for me but or who made that and I stole it I don't know I was obsessed with Tracy Bird I met him at a concert in a at a Walmart okay there was a concert at like Walmart and yeah I met Tracy Bird I was obsessed with Tracy Bird back in the day so yeah I have four of his albums um this is Bella Morte oh my goodness I used to love 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 Bella Morte I still do uh, and Depeche Mode. Still love Depeche Mode. These are the only two I have, but I have a lot of downloaded. Uh, Graver's Paradise. I think it's like a mixture. I'm not entirely sure. I put it in earlier and was listening to it, and I'm still not entirely sure if it's like, if Graver's Paradise is like the name of the CD, and it's like a compilation with other people. I'm gonna have to look that one up. I don't, I don't remember. Uh, Switchblade Symphony. Love, love, love this CD. This CD is like, Oh, um, Diva Destruction. I completely forgot about them until I started going through my CDs and I was just like, oh my goodness. So I'm going to be listening to probably both of these CDs uh, and Bella Morte over and over again this week. So um, The Cure, Necromantics. I love these guys very much. So uh, these were ones that were made, I believe, uh, when I lived in Vegas. This is The Spasmatics. The Spasmatics is a like 80s cover band that plays all over Vegas and like other places too, but The Spasmatics. Um, this is Sierra. Uh, the Skatons. And then this is Destiny's Child. I'm not sure if it's still Destiny's Child, but, you know, we'll, we'll just have to find out. <laughs> Savage Garden, Ace of Bass. Um... This is Tears for Fears. This is the soundtrack from Cecil B. Demented. This is Gwen Stefani, Chameleon Air, Slim Thugga, and Paul Wall. Yes, both of them. Uh, Linkin Park, and uh, this is Hybrid Theory. I just kept the little insert because Chester is in it, and R.I.P. Chester. Um, and then the other one, Meteora. Telepop music, honestly. I put it in and it's just cool music but I really don't know if that's the name of the band or if this is just yeah I don't remember but it's cool music so <laughs> Master P Pink Joss Stone she has a two part album here and then I have her first album here I love me some Joss at the time um, I still love her but yeah uh, Shakira Tupac's Greatest Hits got a two CD disc set right there 
And then Casey and Jojo. I got another Nelly one here. Sarah McLaughlin. Um, TLC Fanel. Enya. Uh, Gary Allen again. Rage Against the Machine. Sarah Evans. And Jennifer Lopez. So that concludes my CD collection. <laughs> Actually, it doesn't because I still have, and I don't even know. I don't. I don't even think these are mine. Um, to be honest with you, because I mean, I don't. I don't recognize this at all. I don't know where this came from, but we're gonna go ahead and open it on camera and see what's in here. Um. Okay, it is mine because there's <laughs> there's Alicia Keys right there, and I actually think. Oh man, I'm. I don't have any more room. You guys, this is this was a bad thing. Like this was, I'm gonna have to get another smaller one of these. And you know they still make them, because I know my husband's like these should belong in a museum somewhere. But no, I'm just saying. So we've got apparently Alicia Keys, Gretchen Wilson. Oh my girl, Gretchen! I forgot about her. Jackal. What is this? Jackal. I did, this is not mine. This is '92. I don't know who that is. Jackal. That's bad. I don't remember who that is. Got Garth Brooks. Got Carrie Underwood. We got Meatloaf, Martina McBride, George Strait, Creed, Cheryl Crow, Pink Floyd, Soul Asylum. Sorry, Patsy Klein. Uh, Carmen, the absolute best. What? Who is this? Carmen. <laughs> no idea. Um, what is this? This is. Oh, I didn't know I had this. See, these are not mine. I've got Johann Sebastian Bach. These are not mine, but they're mine now. I mean, obviously. But... Um, let's see. Ricky Van Shelton, Sammy Hagar, George Michael. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Um, Jim Croyce, The Black Crows, Smashing Pumpkins, heck yeah, Damn Yankees, um, Seals and Crofts, Greatest Hits, and Warrant, Cherry Pie. Oh, I think that's just the front part of Warrant. Okay, so all of these have CDs in them, so I'm gonna have to get another smaller one. Um, I mean, I could keep this, but I really like the ones where you don't have to keep the plastic cases, so... There's that. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this random CD um, exploration of the 90s because, um, yeah, and some of these are even older than that. So, uh, yeah, I will talk to you guys in the next one. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons, and uh, I will talk to you in the next one. Bye, guys.